So this is all the work that you don't really see that happens. It's just getting all the edges, all everything getting it close together. You know, tape lines, so we make sure everything is exact. We're working on this edge right now. Um, we're even adding a little bit of filler to the rock, plastic rocker so there's not so much of a huge transition because this is what it looked like before. And we can even walk around to the other side that has no body work yet. And you can kind of see how these gaps are. We're going to leave these gaps real nice. But look at what we're dealing with on the other side. You see how these are? So we're, we're even adding a little bit of material to the rocker so that everything kind of flows and looks a lot better than that so it's a work in progress but it's coming along i'm hoping this upcoming week that we do the jams and get this thing in the paint so that's my goal Alright guys, so here is the fender mod. Now it's looking pretty nice. We went ahead and put our first pass of Bondo. We even added a little bit to the rocker panel to make it look a little bit nicer as it flows. And we got the boys over here from <laughs> Throttle What's up, man? to look yeah, at this thing. Yeah, yeah. And that this is exactly how I wanted it to look. Ricky's going to be really happy because this was Ricky's idea initially. And uh, you guys made it happen. Holy crap. What I like is you actually integrated the, this is supposed to lay over top of the side skirt. You guys are actually integrating the side skirt into the flare. Exactly. And adding the STI vent. Woo! Yeah, we wanted to go ahead and close up the gap so you don't have issues like over here, right? Because it just looks like you have a void here. So we want to yeah. make sure it just kind of smooths it out and kind of flows real nice. Yeah, that, that's a touch or detail that we didn't even anticipate. So that's awesome. Gonna look really, really nice. Finally, nice and smooth. Everything is gonna align too, like you know how it was a little bit off and stuff like that. Everything's gonna look like it's supposed to. Oh, we can get rid of that funky little yeah guy that was in here. Remember, it was yeah, like yeah. yeah, really sick dude. And the gap between the panels is gonna mm -hmm. be nice. Exactly. Ooh. Now we still gotta do this and we still gotta do the other ones, but hey, I think we're making pretty good headway. All the bodywork on the car is pretty much all done. So now it's just the kit. And it's been a little bit of a nightmare, but uh, it's <laughs> coming along. It. Definitely. Go to SEMA. It'll be worth it. Oh, don't. Oh. oh. oh what I do? I'm just bro. kidding. I'm just oh. kidding. Oh, <laughs> it's not wet. It is. Well, it was, they, was it wet. wet. Yeah, it was wet. It dried. It, it dried. Yeah. You got a little it funky. Yeah. yeah. A lot of work, but man, you guys are crushing it. Yeah. It's coming out nice. And I think. Uh, the color, where did it go? So, let's show the color. Can we show these guys the color? You already showed it, homie. <laughs> you showed yeah, it. You showed it. You showed it. I should have took it off, but I didn't. So we, went, we chose this color here, which is a variation of Subaru's World Rally Blue. Super pretty with the SOS uh, Flash throttle touch to it. Yes, sir. Really excited to see this sprayed on the car in a, in a large format. It's going to be beautiful. Definitely. Yeah.
many hours later. Guys, at this point in the video, I want to stop and give a huge thank to the Total Sales guy. He always coming through and supporting us on all our builds. And today, he bought us some more goodies for this car. So let's take a look at what he bought us. New hoodie alert. Dad caps as well. All right, guys, everything is in the booth. It is finally time to spray this stuff down. We're gonna put some thick primer on this stuff and let it sit over the weekend. So next weekend, we can get everything painted. So let's take a look at these pieces and see how they came out. So here are, I think these are the front bumper extensions. Went ahead and added some material. Actually, the rest of the kit actually wasn't too bad, but you know, we had to add a little bit on the portion where it actually butts up so everything looks nice and crisp the rears too not too bad actually you know just a little bit of material the side skirts we ended up adding a lot more material than usually is needed because we wanted it to match up here we have the side skirts and here we have the front benders now these these bad boys these were the biggest bitch but they got done and they are ready for some primer. And here we have all the rear arches, and they're all ready. Everything is ready. We're gonna go ahead and spray these today, and tomorrow we're gonna see them all ready to go.
right guys, so that concludes today's video. Finally finished up with all the body work for the throttle STI. So that's gonna conclude the second video. Next video you're gonna see this thing getting painted and getting the final assemble done. So I wanna take this moment to give all you guys a shout out for watching the videos and uh, supporting us here. And if you are one of the original SOS Custom Supporter, wanna let you know that we have some new merch dropping. Here is one of the designs on a hoodie, SOS Customs. We also have some dad hats. Me, personally, I love dad hats. Uh, we got some snapbacks, we got some hoodies, some shirts. So all that merch is gonna be dropping here real soon. Um, and we're gonna continue to show off all the new designs. Again, uh, big ups to all you guys for watching. We'll see you guys next time. Here at SOS Customs, we got you covered. We got you covered.